So right as I hit record, my sister decided to just take a shower. So if you hear that in the background, I'm sorry. <laughs> hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a fall clothing haul slash makeup. There's a little bit of makeup. I don't really know what's going on with my hair. I tried to do my best and fix with it. I went shopping today and I got some clothes. It's kind of a smaller haul from ones that I've done in the past, but you guys are always requesting for me to do new haul videos, so... I'm coming back with one for the fall. Um, I wanted to do this video later and make it a collective haul, but I just wanted to film this video this week, so there's not that much stuff, but I still hope you guys like this video. If you do and you're new to my channel, please subscribe. I upload videos every single Monday. My hair usually does not look like this. Yeah, so with all that being said, if you guys like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and let's go ahead and get into what I got. So I went to Aeropostale because I think they're going bankrupt, and so like literally everything in their store is like on sale even like their new stuff. So the first one is this jacket. Now note that in Texas I can't really wear like any of the stuff that I got today but it doesn't really matter. It's just like this army green coat jacket thing. I am obsessed with it. I really like it. It fits me really well so I'm excited to wear this. I wanted to get it as a size too big but they didn't have a small so I had to settle with the extra small. And I am very excited to wear it over like sweaters and stuff like that when it gets a little bit cooler outside. I got two sweaters from Aeropostale. The first one is this like creamy white colored one and then it's got the navy blue sleeves and it's also navy blue at the bottom but I really like this because it's super soft and it's kind of cropped just a little bit to wear like I can wear it with like high-waisted jeans or whatever. The other sweater that I got is kind of similar, but it is not really similar. I don't know why I said that. It's like a dark gray color. It looks like this. Pretty simple, but I think it's really nice to just have lots of like staple sweaters that you can just throw on over like leggings or jeans or something. That's what I'm wearing 90% of the time during the fall, so. I also went to American Eagle and I got this sweater and it's so soft. I got it a size too big, so it looks kind of big. I just knew it would be super comfortable and stuff, like, obviously. It's just a dark gray color like the other one. It's got this open shoulder little thing right here, which I think is adorable. So this is what it looks like, and I know I will be wearing this a lot over jeans, so glad I got this. And last clothing piece that I got, I told you guys this haul was kind of small, but it doesn't really matter. I got a new pair of jeans. These are from American Eagle. So they're pretty simple. I love the way they, they fit. I've been picking up a few things from Sephora the past few weeks and I've decided to mention them in this video just to make it a little bit longer. But first one is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. I got this one a few weeks ago, but I honestly really, really like this product. You can use it as like a setting spray or a primer before your makeup, which is really nice. So if you're interested in getting this, I highly recommend you get it. If you don't use it every day, it's really nice to have for like special events and stuff like that when you want your makeup to last a lot longer. I also got, this bottle is like really dirty, so just ignore that, but this is the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquefied Matte Longwear Lipstick. This one lasts so long. Like, honestly, it will last until you take it off with makeup remover. Plus, I really like the color. By the way, I've got it on my lips right now. I forgot to mention that. I also got the Tarte um, Amazonian Clay Matte Waterproof Bronzer in the shade Park Ave Princess. I really like the packaging. It's like a leather kind of a thing. Like, it's been my everyday bronzer recently. I really like it blends really well and I just like the color on my skin. Last thing in this haul is the Benefit Roller Lash Mascara. My mom actually got this for me. Honestly, I'm not that impressed with it. I thought it would be a lot better than it really is. I've heard some people talk about how they like it, but honestly, I don't really see anything good about it. It's not bad, but for being a high-end mascara, I would definitely um, expect more out of it. So that is everything in this haul. If you guys like this video, again, do not forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. If you are new, it will be down below. And I will talk to you next week. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.